BMW is showcasing the new Nui class, which aims to revolutionize the brand. The modern name Nui class represents an entire architecture for next-generation electric vehicles. The Nui class platform is specifically designed for electric vehicles and integrates batteries into the car's structure. Battery packs range from 75.0 to 150.0 kWh, with the transmission supporting 800 volt blocks and fast charging up to 270 kW. When connected, the Nui class can increase its range by 30 miles per minute. Models built on the Nui class architecture use cylindrical batteries developed by BMW themselves. They offer 30% more energy in the same size as current prismatic elements. These packs can provide a range of 1,000 km between charges. The Nui class platform can accommodate various electric motors ranging from 268 to 1341 horsepower, the latter rumored to feature a quad-engine setup. The transmission supports rear-wheel and all-wheel drive configurations. It is also possible to use two drives only for rear-wheel drive. By the end of the decade, BMW will release four more cars on this platform. It is reported that they will include entry-level electric car offerings like the i1 and i2. Additionally, in 2026, a coupe-shaped crossover 94 will be introduced. While BMW does not provide many details about performance models running on the Nui class platform, the company has trademarked the name M3, and there are rumors that a potential M model could use a quad motor providing 1341 horsepower. If BMW follows its usual release strategy, expect less powerful models to come a year or two after the standard versions. The first model on the Nui class platform will debut in the second half of 2025. Initially, BMW will produce Nui class models in Debrecen, Hungary, and Shenyang, China. The company will start assembling them in Germany in 2026, with other models coming from Mexico starting in 2027. With at least six cars set to run on the Nui class platform, they will be available at different price points. Although we don't have solid figures yet, the new batteries are reportedly cheaper than current ones. Lower production costs mean that the model's prices may be closer to existing models running on traditional engines.